woken up and seeing my phone's blown up because Anton's finally replied about this boxing fight um, with the worst call out video ever mentions on behalf of all women Anton cut this shit big man listen I'll be more than happy to fight you bro for thousands of pounds to punch your face as many times as I can uh, I'm up for it 100% it's not on behalf of all women Anton because that's a TV show and this is real life um, so we know we don't like each other I've got no respect you at all uh sign the contract let's get some money and let me punch all that botox out of your face big man right, a few points i want to cover with this one i got sent this um about 20 minutes ago and he'd put it up like an hour ago so first of all why are you getting up at 12 o'clock in the day are you okay secondly all you do is talk about fucking money is things that bad i get you never got the boohoo man deal you wanted because you were in the villa for like, what, five minutes? Um, yeah, like, we can set up a GoFundMe page for you or something, mate. We'll help you out. Don't worry about it. But, mate, enough of this chat going back and forward. And it is for women, but you wouldn't understand that. You wouldn't understand what it's like to have respect, not even for women, for anyone. Listen to the way you talk. You don't have respect for no one, mate. And I would love to put punch some fucking sense into you. I would love to do it. And do you know what? I would do it for free. Anton sent for me again, so I might as well respond whilst I'm stuck in Derby, waiting to go back to Sheffield. Um, keeps having this narrative of me being disrespectful to women. <sighs> That's TV, this is real life. Anton, after TV, you, you treat Georgia wrong. Like, I ain't treat any woman wrong off TV. On TV, I have. Off TV, I haven't. So, don't know where you're getting that from. Um, Anton, I've grown up round fighters my whole life. My dad were a boxer. One of my close mate, Kel, was a champion. Literally won the world championship back in the day. But my best mate's brother is a boxer. You know what I mean? All my friends are boxers. So it's all taught this and the other. I'm in the environment of boxers. You're not a fighter, Anton. So as much as you look good, you might look good, big man. But you cannot fight for shit. Believe me. So I've just seen Mitchie's Snapchat story. So apparently, because you've grown up around people that can box, means you can box as well. Um, I don't claim. To be a fighter mate, don't claim to be a boxer, never put a set of boxing gloves on and I'm still going to beat you, I'm still going to beat you and that's going to be embarrassing for you, I mean how does that even work in someone's head that you've grown up around people that fight so that means you can fight, amazing. Then secondly he's going on about Georgia, me treating Georgia bad, when? I think you'll find what happened with the Georgia situation, as everyone well knows, is I was the one that was used in that situation. And yeah, what can you say? Everyone told me, everyone's seen it with their own eyes. And I actually tried to see past it and do the right thing. And now I've been bad to Georgia. And what planet are you on? Are you that delusional that you think that? Or are you trying to re jig the narrative as you tried to when I was in the villa so yeah and if she's slid in your DMs mate do you know what it would not surprise me it would not surprise me um, but that is in the past all that shit's in the past what's that got to do with my beef for you um, so yeah mate keep coming with your shitty excuses keep coming with your stories you wake up at 12 o'clock in the day you've got nothing going for you I hope you get this fight because it sounds like you need the money and I can't mate you're not a worker you will not work a day in your life. And when it comes to boxing, you can't fake this shit. You have to put the graft in, mate. And honestly, see the thing is about me, I'm in my office now. I've been working since five o'clock this morning, mate. I'm a grafter with everything I do. So I will train twice a day, three times a day to make sure that I knock that smug look off your 